All right, I hope everyone enjoyed Yosemite Sam. It is now time to do our accessory work. And this is a total dude bro workout, right? Dudes, bros. It's time to do some good old muscle pump, some good old fashioned upper body muscle pump with some dumbbells. So with that, we've got four different movements programmed. First one will be a single dumbbell bench press. If you don't have a bench press, that's gonna be a floor press. If you're doing this though, what I would like you to do is I would like you to focus this on a two second negative, okay? Meaning you get that dumbbell overhead, we're here, we're two seconds down, drive it up, all right? Two seconds down, drive it up, all right? Once you've done 10 on the one arm, we're gonna switch over to the other side, and we're gonna be two seconds down, and drive it up. The reason why I want you to use one dumbbell is it's gonna make you fire a lot more stabilizer muscles. All right, so here we are again, two down, one up. Just drive that thing right up as fast as you can. Be explosive there. Okay, after we're done that, we are moving that over into dumbbell rows. So our dumbbell rows, stand that up, single dumbbell rows. So I like to think of you getting that weight almost dead center, and we're here, and we're two seconds negative down, bring that up, we're two seconds negative down, pop that up, two seconds, Just finish those 10 reps on the one arm, we're here, one 1,000, two 1,000. Again, keeping that good flat back though, okay? And when that dumbbell comes up, it should be somewhere between that rib cage, belly button area. All right, we're done that. We're getting back down on the ground again. And we are going to do skull crushers. So skull crushers. Getting those dumbbells locked overhead, right? We're bringing them back. Those elbows don't move. They're in nice and tight. And we're in here. And just because they're called skull crushers, keep them controlled and don't drop those dumbbells into your skull, okay? If two dumbbells is too much for you, the other option would be is to grab that single dumbbell and work that back, right? And keep those elbows in a nice, tight, fixed position, okay? And then after that, we're gonna move into dumbbell flies. So, with that, you're probably gonna want some lighter weights. With that, you're gonna be in that bent over position and we're taking those dumbbells out, straight out. You should see them almost in your peripheral vision when you're doing that. Keeping a good back position, we're doing 10 dumbbell flies, okay? That's our reps for today. Good luck, have fun. Can't wait to see you again Wednesday. Don't forget, we're gonna do a Facebook Live for that workout on Tuesday morning.